All right, so I'm going to show you how to make a swirly phaser pad that uh, Daft Punk uses in some of their songs. You can hear it at the beginning of Digital Love uh, in the background. Now let's start by initializing it patch. Turn off a uh, re-trigger on all oscillators, part A and B. And uh, so our oscillator one, we have a sawtooth wave with one voice. Uh, detune that sl slightly to 0 0.1 with the fine tune knob. And oscillator two, let's change to a triangle wave with one voice and pitched one octave up. And on part B, on oscillator one, uh, use a sawtooth wave with one voice. Uh, the reason to use the triangle wave is just to give a kind of sparkly, kind of bell-like tone at a higher frequency in the pad. And since we want the pad to come in kind of smooth, and let's increase the amp envelope attack to about five, the decay to about five, sustain to seven, and release to five, and then do the same on part B. And for both filter A and B, let's use a low pass and increase the drive just a little bit on both filters. And on the master filter control, let's open it up about to seven and a half. And then we want to add an envelope to the filter as well. So choose cut off A, B, and mod envelope one, and turn the knob to the left. And what that's going to do is make it so the frequency sweeps from a lower frequency to a higher frequency. Change the attack to two, decay to seven, sustain to seven, and release to five. low frequency oscillator one choose side wave and then choose cut off a and b turn the knob to the right a little bit increase the rate and gain and now you can hear the uh, LFOs modulating the cutoff as you hold down the the notes, uh, it's a good idea to to put uh, filter modulation on on most pads to keep interest high. And it kind of keeps something going on in the background that your ears don't really pick up on, but it's it's still catchy. And then let's go ahead and add chorus on the effects rack. Also add a phaser. Try decreasing the uh, alpha rate a little bit on the phaser. If you open up the cutoff filter all the way, you're gonna get a more sparkly tones from the high frequencies. And also try compressing the signal as well. If you want to get a, a thicker pad sound, um, you can increase 
the voices on all the oscillators. Try increasing them to eight. Thickens up the sound a pretty good amount. And then if you want to add some more, I guess, noise to it, just go on oscillator B2, uh, choose white noise, one voice, and turn the volume down. Volume should be pretty low, but it adds uh, more depth to the sound. Just kind of a, a nice white noise if that's what you're looking for. And that's about it. Uh, there's, if you want to get a kind of cool ar arpeggiator out of the sound um, on both amp envelopes, turn the attack all the way down. And on the filter envelope, turn the attack down too. And activate the arpeggiator. arpeggiator sound out of it and uh, that's about it I play uh, a quick chord so you can hear it Sweep the cut off a little bit. 